What is up guys, Felix Gaming here and today we are going to be showing you how to, you can get onto the internet using your Nintendo Switch and I believe you can do this with just about any one of them. Uh, personally I'm using just like the, uh, not the OLED model but the, uh, the second newest Nintendo Switch, not the Switch Lite, not the very first one but kind of just middle ground to show you guys that this can work on just about any of them and uh, yeah. It's going to be very easy. I'm going to show you how to connect to the internet and also how to take that all back so it's back to normal. Uh, yeah, I mean, I've had a couple of people ask for a tutorial on that, though, so I figured why not do it? So first thing you want to do is go down to settings. And then you want to come down to internet because obviously we're going to be changing our internet settings. Click on internet settings. Now you're going to want to look for the internet that you are connected to currently. Now we wait for that and you're just going to want to click on it. And then you want to go down to change settings. And this is kind of where you're going to want to pay attention. You got to go to DNS settings. Click on that. Change it to manual. Alrighty. And now you want to change your primary DNS. We're just going to take all of that off of there. And we are going to change it to 0, 4, 5, 0, 5, 5, 1, 4, 2, 1, 2, 2. And you do have to put the little dots in. Uh, it's a little annoying, but you want to make sure you get it right. Alrighty. Now, you can go over to Save. I believe it's gonna say settings have been changed alrighty click on it and that's totally fine now what you want to do is go to connect to this network and it should not connect right away uh, it should connect at least to the network device but it should not connect to the internet and if it doesn't that's how you know you've done it right this does take a while though so just awesome so now we click next and now we are actually on Google. This is pretty cool. Um, it's very fast. See, yeah, you just want to go continue to Google. So click A. And boom, here we are. We are actually on Google. This is 100% working. To prove it, let's go to www. Instagram dot com. Well, that was just the wrong one. Backslash, and then we'll try looking for mine, which we all know is fail at gaming. Oh, completely forgot the L. I N G and I believe Y T and uh, this should work so let's uh, try it some uh, sources are a little too big for it but as you guys can see we are on Google you can zoom out using the uh, the right joy-con not the joy-con the joystick and of course you can use your left one for the cursor so let's click on this one loading up Instagram and would you look at that guys it actually gives us the option to log in and whatnot uh, I am right now just not going to but if you look we are a hundred percent actually on here look we can click we can go through the reels like it does work guys this is 100 percent not some sort of like scammy thing, whatnot. Boohoo. See if I can view past stories. Yep. So we have to log in, but you can do it. All right. So now we actually want to reverse all of this. So what we're going to do, we're just going to click back, 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 or we can click X to end it all. 
and close the screen. Now we're going to go back up to our normal settings. We're going to let it load. Click on the one that we were already on. Change settings. Go down to our DNS. Click automatic. Save it. Savings have been changed. And let's try to reconnect to the network. And as you guys can see, that connected incredibly fast. But we no longer have the option to go onto Chrome. Now, with being able to go onto Chrome, the possibilities are truly endless. All right. You may not be able to load up browser games, but that won't stop you from downloading um, possibly APKs, uh, meaning that this is kind of like an Android device in some sense. Uh, I mean, there obviously are tutorials to do that where you can actually download the Android software, but I'm not sure if it 100% works for this. So try it at your own risk. This is safe though. This is just to get a browser on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, if you guys liked the video, please leave a comment uh, or even just a like. Um, if you have any questions or you want me to do another tutorial, please let me know down in the comments or you guys can message me at Instagram, uh, Twitter, I'm on TikTok. Pretty much I'll have a link down below. It's going to be solo.to backslash gaming. That is going to have a all-in-one link to all of my socials where you guys can catch up with me. And uh, yeah, just ask anything. If you don't want to miss any more content just like this, please make sure to subscribe. And if you want to get notified for that, click the little bell and change it to all. That way you will never miss out when I upload another video. But I believe that is everything, guys. So I'm just going to end this video saying thank you so much for watching. And uh, yeah, until next time.